Today, I'm going to crank up the voltage on a DC motor and see what really happens. Will it go faster, or will it explode? Let's find out. DC motors are all around us, from power tools to kids' toys, and even in some critical applications, like medical devices and industrial machinery. But have you ever wondered how they work and what happens when you change their voltage? One common misconception about DC motors is that they can handle any voltage you throw at them, but that's far from the truth. In reality, motors are designed to operate within a specific voltage range, and deviating from that range can lead to serious issues. For instance, running a motor at a higher voltage can cause it to overheat, while running it at a lower voltage can result in reduced performance and efficiency. The challenges of operating motors at incorrect voltage levels are very real, and it's essential to understand the implications. Another misconception is that motors will always draw the same amount of current, regardless of the voltage. However, this is not the case. When you increase the voltage, the motor will actually draw less current, but it will also produce more power. On the other hand, when you decrease the voltage, the motor will draw more current, but it will produce less power. This is a critical point to understand, as it can affect the motor's performance, efficiency, and even its lifespan. Operating a motor outside its recommended voltage range can also lead to premature wear and tear reduced torque and increased energy consumption. For example, if you're using a motor designed for 12 volts in a 24 volt system, you can expect it to overheat and eventually fail. Similarly, if you're using a motor designed for 24 volts in a 12 volt system, it will struggle to produce the necessary power and torque. In addition to these challenges, there's also the issue of safety. Running a motor at the wrong voltage can create electrical hazards, such as sparking or even electrical fires. So, it's crucial to understand the implications of voltage changes on DC motors and to operate them within their recommended voltage ranges. When you increase the voltage of a DC motor, the speed of the motor increases, but so does the current drawn by the motor. This means that the motor will produce more power, but it will also generate more heat. On the other hand, when you decrease the voltage, the speed of the motor decreases, and the current drawn by the motor also decreases. This means that the motor will produce less power, but it will also generate less heat. The relationship between voltage and speed is not always linear, and it can vary depending on the specific motor design and application. For instance, some motors may exhibit a more dramatic increase in speed as the voltage increases, while others may show a more gradual increase. Similarly, the relationship between voltage and torque can also vary, with some motors producing more torque as the voltage increases, while others may produce less torque. As you can see, changing the voltage of a DC motor can have significant effects on its performance, efficiency, and lifespan. But what about the critical threshold of voltage changes? At what point do these effects become too severe, and the motor starts to fail? In general, most DC motors can handle a 10 to 20% variation in voltage without any issues. However, exceeding this range can lead to serious problems, such as overheating, reduced torque, and even complete motor failure. For example, if you're using a motor designed for 12 volts in a 15 volt system, you may not notice any significant issues at first. However, as time goes on, the motor may start to overheat, and its performance may begin to degrade. On the other hand, if you're using a motor designed for 24 volts in a 20 volt system, you may not notice any significant issues, but the motor may not be producing its full power and torque. In real-world applications, the implications of voltage changes can be severe. For instance, in industrial settings, using motors at the wrong voltage can lead to reduced productivity, increased energy consumption, and even safety hazards. Similarly, in medical devices, using motors at the wrong voltage can lead to device failure, which can have serious consequences for patients. Thanks for watching, and if you've had any experiences with DC motors, please leave a comment below and share your story. Also, be sure to check out our related videos for more insights into the world of motors and electronics.